Hi everybody, so here's a quick video on exporting MIDI from Dorco and importing it into a DAW. For years now I've had an issue where my notation program exports all of this extraneous performance data like panning, volume, program changes, and other MIDI CC information. I actually don't want any of that, I just want the notes. So if you're like me and you're using Dorico, here's a quick solution. I have a few measures here for string section and I want to just export the MIDI so that I can import it into Cubase and work on a mock-up. I'll play just on piano what it should sound like. So I'll export this by going to File, Export MIDI. And then in Cubase, File, Import MIDI. Now it asks me if I want to create a new project. What I found is that if you say yes, that you'll create a new Cubase project with all of the MIDI and the correct bar lines, tempos, meter changes, everything like that. But what I usually want to do is to import MIDI into my Cubase template. The problem there has been that Cubase then won't import the tempo and meter changes from the MIDI file. So to fix that, you have to go to Edit, Preferences, under MIDI File, make sure that this box, Ignore Master Track Events on Merge, is unchecked. Now when I import MIDI, I can import directly into the Cubase session that I'm already using and all of that important data like tempo and meter will import as well. But there's still a big problem here. Listen to this. There are extra notes, extra MIDI data, things I don't want. In Cubase, you can see in these automation lanes which MIDI CC control has information. So CC1, obviously, pan, MIDI volume, program change, Really, I just want velocities, because I'll want to control the volume changes in Cubase myself. And I don't want those extra notes, which are actually just key switches from Dorico. So I'll go back into Dorico, go to the Play menu under Playback Template. You might have a template selected here. The default is probably the Halion Sonic template. There might be a better way to bypass that, but the way I've gotten around it is to go into Settings and switch the expression map from HSO to default for each one. I'm guessing you can also create a new expression map in Dorico that has all of these default mappings. Once I do that, I'll export the MIDI once again, import it into Cubase, and I no longer have the key switches. Also have less extraneous MIDI CC data, which is how I prefer it. There are still some defaults like MIDI volume, and you can always look at the list editor view and delete anything other than notes. So that's it for this one. Many of you probably already know how to do this, but I'm sure if you're like me, you've had the same issues over the years. Thanks for watching and see you next time.